okay let's start to uh, create a image capture example in windows form uh, so good morning everyone uh, create a new uh, windows form app uh, in visual studio 2017 actually uh, i have used so there are multiple options in visual studio 2017 that is a cross platform environment for the ios android and uh, and so but the tutorial is related to windows form so select windows form app uh, in Im image captcha actually i need a picture box and two button control for the generating a new image and uh, one text box control uh, for uh, putting the value of the image for verification so in the design point of view single uh, picture box and the one button control for verification or you can use also image button here for your uh, refreshment for refreshing the button so it's in rate Okay. Now uh, take a text box control and the button control for verification. Now put a text box control and the button control. You can change the name of the button control the main thing uh, in the code file because it's a design uh, you can also uh, you can design easily by using the toolbox okay uh, the first time when uh, your image is loaded on your form so initialize uh, just after initialize component uh, make sure your method is working and you can create a method okay uh, load captcha uh, there is no options of uh, to generate a method stub so click designer view it's not there okay let's do uh, create manually if uh, intelligence sometimes uh, the image uh, or uh, intelligence is not work uh, void so create manually the method stub or you can say the method definition before uh, creating your captcha image first to remember that uh, if you want to create a uh, numbered captcha in the form of the image so first of all generate a number uh, that is random number and uh, that random number in between that 500 to 1000 and 1 to 1000 there is your choice you can create so create uh, add a class that is random class and uh, you can okay so r1 dot next uh, in the next method add the range between the numbers that is 500 to 1000 three digit or the um, three digit numbers actually i want to show in a image tab create that number in the form of the image so use bitmap class a bitmap class have multiple options that is image original and uh, okay so image original is displayed on the picture box so set the picture box width and the picture box height in the bitmap okay uh, also set the font class or you can say font family now 
in the font class there are uh, multiple options for the font that is prototype and you can say the font family of the pro uh, font prototype that is Arial and the font style is uh, italic bold and underlined font size is 30 font style dot bold okay now the graphics unit also set in the font class that is pixel okay now use the graphics uh, use a draw string of the graphics class graphics dot from image and uh, I have an image is IMG with the picture box and uh, you can draw the graphics and draw the um, image using draw string so I want to draw that is number on the draw string font that is font and um, brushes use the color of the text brushes dot and the font point point refer to the where uh, your start your image okay let's to draw the image on the picture box so picture box one dot image equals to img okay that's fine now when we click on the refresh button that is uh, located in the button one click that is the refresh of the button uh, so load captcha again for the new random number and in the display in the images uh, also and when we click on the button 2 that is verification of, with the text box okay text box 1 dot text is double equals to number dot to string is equal if number uh, or the text box is equal and message box dot dot show match otherwise not match so thank you thank you very much for watching this video tutorial of windows form and welcome my channel uh, please subscribe my channel if you like this video also share this video um, because uh, uh, times ago so guys I request you please subscribe my channel and uh, I'm sure uh, I will provide you better video tutorial of Windows form and further so thank you thank you very much again you can check your output of Windows form just by clicking on the start button of the green triangle so thank you uh, check with the yeah not match 5 to 1 so thank you very much again you can check your uh, code as well as your output thank you very much